is suffering part of human nature. The Buddha says desire is the cause of all suffering, every human will go through the suffering of birth, life and death. In between there is mental suffering, physical suffering and much more. Suffering can be seen in many different ways, can be explained in many different ways. The same with desire, we desire food, happiness, love. Desire can also be seen as attachments, attachment to be a good person, to become a better person. Suffering can be seen in many different ways, from a human perspective and a spiritual perspective. As humans we are being taught suffering is part of life, no matter how much you have, the suffering is part of it. Buddha also said it is the ignorance that does not allow us to see through the suffering. Ignorance meaning not having the knowledge of what is behind the suffering, what is the suffering and how do we deal or negate the suffering we feel and see within ourselves and around us. We even might have an attachment to suffering. We need to understand desire, we need to understand suffering to move beyond the wrong or right of the desires and suffering. All attachments we have in the physical and in the spiritual. Understand how we think and act in the spiritual and apply this to the physical. In a spiritual reality that is beyond suffering and desire we observe and react. In a human world of suffering and desire we act and observe. Reality is that what we call suffering is part of a thought system that keeps us in the mindset of suffering and desires that attach us to the human reality of control. Life and death is not suffering it is movement through the greater experience of spirit. All the suffering in between can be understood through knowledge of the one mind within our own being. All the suffering we go through now is the same as the suffering we went through many lifetimes, when we can stop seeing it as suffering, and can understand what we call suffering, changes can be made. The human mind will work against us in many ways when we try and understand what is desire, what is suffering, what is human experience, what is the reality of human life upon earth. We will stop ourselves many times not allowing ourselves to understand the human extension of our real being. Wishing we would not have to deal with the mundane reality of human life, not having to deal with all the desire, suffering, attachments of human life. If we cannot trust within our own being the understanding of our purpose upon earth, what or who can we trust? The trust is something that is or has a need to come from within, as the human feels the desire to go within and find all the answers. Once we trust within, the desire disappears, the attachments disappear and the suffering disappears and become something that cannot be explained in human words within the human reality as it becomes or you have become your spiritual reality. A place where suffering, desire and attachments do not exist.